Hey collective and welcome back to Empress Intuition 1111. We're going to go ahead and hop into your ancestor messages to see what's going on. I hope you guys are all doing well and had a great day. I hope you have fun for the weekend. If it's your birthday, happy birthday. If it's your birthday weekend, hey, happy birthday. You're about to be looking cute, having fun, getting your hair done, your nails done, your toes painted. You might go like on a boat cruise or ship, not a ship, but like a boat ride or something like that, a cruise or something. I'm seeing that. Like a yellow two-piece swimsuit with like a cover-up. Brown skin in the sun. Ooh, I see that. If you could be a white girl too as well. I'm seeing just different people having different like vacation trips and stuff like that because you know summer's almost out we got the fall time coming in so we're gonna go ahead and shuffle these cards and see what does the collective want you to know what does your ancestors want you to know five or six somebody trying to go up against you yeah somebody it's a lot of chaos around you da um daughter of baskets i feel like somebody's jealous of you because you've been chosen for something or you've been picked for something with the seven of coins somebody watching how much money you got or where you're getting it from and with the bones, something I just said was facts. You're going to be shocked about something when you watch this video. One, two, three on a timer. Yeah, seven of baskets came out as well. I feel like you're very fruitful. You have a lot of things going on for you. Yeah, four of sticks. You also, um, your ancestors want you to know true love is coming in for you at this time as well. And whatever fighting is going on behind the scenes, they're fighting hard for you at this time as well. And the torch is in your hand. This could be um, like a past auntie, a grandma. It's like a motherly figure that's coming out. And they're watching over you. There's all women on the board. So these are all women. So I feel like these are strong leaders that have passed away. We're going to go ahead and see. What does the ancestors want you to know? I thank you guys and appreciate you guys for letting me tap into your energy to tell you what's going on. I love the fact that you give me the time and the day to even channel these messages for you. We all are busy, have a lot to do. 222 on the timer. We are in alignment and we're going to stay in alignment, period. Okay, what's coming out at the top of the deck? Limited prosperity is coming in. You have the altar of earth, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. I just seen 234 on the timer. Okay, what's the five of six? Holy Spirit, ancestors, what is the five of six? Yeah, manifestation. Somebody wants to come in and try to block your manifestations. They could be doing rituals and money spells in reverse on your money. Yeah, but your miracles are in motion, mother of God. They want to let you know your miracles are in motion. No one can stop it for the daughter of baskets. So uh, mother of God is watching over the daughter of baskets at this time. And her miracles are coming into motion for her. What's the seven of coins? What is the seven of coins, Holy Spirit? Okay, we got a couple cards. Yeah, Father of Water, Balance and Harmony. Seven of Coins, you're going to, they're bringing you a lot of balance at this time and harmony as well. Taking you to calmer waters, 333 three, three on the timer. Yeah, Ancestral Force, what I tell you is a competition. Somebody's competing with you with your destiny or they're competing with you. It's something that you do or something like that or they're mad and they're jealous of you because they can't be like you. So they're trying to cause some kind of competition or negative forces yeah destruction chaos what i tell you with the five of sticks is a lot of destruction and chaos around these people clarify the seven of baskets holy spirit what is the seven of baskets for my collective that's too many hold on we're gonna take the one that fell out on top yeah limited prosperity like i said everything that you're doing right now is very fruitful when somebody is watching this and they're jealous with the seven of baskets they see you finna come up out here you're doing something the right way or something like that and they're just jealous of like your abundance and your fruitfulness and your beauty. Nurture and harvest. Yeah, you like to nurture things. You're a har you harvest things out here. You know how to, um, you know, you're a creator. You're like a light worker. You're a light worker. You're creative. You could be like a star seed or something like that. Yeah, you're very highly a sensitive person. You could also be a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces as well. So we got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. And um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and Aries, Leo, Sag. So we have pretty much all the signs out here, all the zodiacs. Okay. Yeah, and that's the truth, what I just said. Clarity, Ace of Swords, 
altar of air is clarity. That is the truth. Five o'clock on the timer. Okay, we're going to pull a few more. Let's pull some angel messages for y'all. Yeah, Archangel Metron, spiritual power. So what he's doing is protecting your spiritual powers and your gifts right now and your destiny. Nobody can take nothing from you or try to alter your destiny or like somehow put themselves in it or swap destinies with you. There's been a lot of people trying to swap destinies. 623 on the timer when I just said that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and clarify. Clarify the manifestation card. What does the angels want my collective to know regarding this situation? What I tell you? Yeah, goddess, Gala, the provider. You are the provider out here. People see that you're the provider. That's why you're the daughter of baskets. Because you're the provider. You make things happen in the family. You're breaking the generational curse. I just seen um, 555. Yeah, you're changing something. You're making a massive change right now. Ooh. Yeah, you're passionate in growth. You have a lot of passion and growth right now. You're very passionate and people can see your growth and they can see your heart is um your heart is not it's real. It's not fake. You don't wear a mask. This is really who you are. What does the collective need to know from the ancestors? Thank you. Yeah, Baba Gaga, Baba Yaga. She's the wise one and the wild woman. Duality and the witch. So yeah, you're the witch out here. You're the real witch. And if you see you got all the colors calm and harmony relationships and healing so yeah your ancestors bring you to calmer waters a new relationship a fresh start prosperity money love abundance everything you're asking for is going to come in for you it's already happening period confirmation okay now we're going to do signs of the times to see what's going on you know, of course, everything is black and white, no gray areas. You have the butterfly metamorphosis. You're transforming right now. Pay attention to your angel numbers because they're guiding you, okay? I just see 707. What does the collective need to know? What does the collective need to know regarding signs of the times, Holy Spirit? Okay. Yeah, black loot is enlightenment. You're getting a lot of enlightenment on people, situations, things. Okay. Keep boundaries up is also what I'm seeing. Yeah. Liberate journey. You're on a new journey right now. It doesn't involve these people. Yeah, you're focused on your destiny right now. Like I told you, somebody trying to destiny swap with you or some shit like that. But it's not going to work. You got way too many people in the spirit realm. Yeah, the traffic cone. They need to take caution on what they're doing. They're going up the wrong, against the wrong person. That's what I'm hearing. Whoever goes up against you is going up against God. So they need to just slow down and pump their brakes is also what I'm getting. Okay, Holy Spirit, what does the collective need to know? Yeah, the bees, the community know about something. They know that you're the truth out here. Somebody's seeing something for what it is and not for what they was told. Okay. Yin and yang, you got a lot of balance. Trust no bitch and trust no man. Period. 808 on the timer. Yeah, anchor stability. You could be buying a house or you just moved into one. But you're making yourself have full stability out here. You're no longer dealing with apartments or townhomes. You want to live in a house and be like a luxurious home. And go home. I'm hearing a lot of people say, I'm going to go home. But they go home to an apartment. Or they go home to a townhouse. And nothing's wrong with that. But you're about to go home to a new house. Your ancestors are about to put you in a house. With the seashell abundance. I cannot make this up. <laughs> Period. Love is on. Love is going to come in right along with this abundance. Oh my God. I'm so excited for you guys. You cannot make this up. Okay. So what else? What is the universal messages for the collective? Yeah. Fill out. An expired park fill up an expired parking meter a little change goes a long way to make someone's day so somebody might not have enough money to uh to like to park there for too long so you can fill up the meter for them yeah you already know the answers is within you okay so some of y'all already know this is what's going on and you guys know what's happening make friends with somebody at work or school because you know school just started back so go out there and make some friends have fun and keep practicing your chakra healings and the universe has a plan for you don't worry about it subscribe